guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a Amazon favorites video and I've actually been waiting for this video because I wanted to make sure that everything that I had ordered came in so I can share with you guys everything that I have been getting. And this video is literally everything pink. So if you guys are a big fan of the color pink, then you guys are going to love everything that I've been picking up from Amazon. And I'm kind of doing like a little revamp to my beauty room. Um, like you guys know, I had a lot of like the black and white aesthetic uh, previous in my old videos and in my old beauty room. And it was very just black and white. So now I'm trying to transition more to like a girlier feel and add like some gold and some... Um, like pops of pink and just make it really feminine so I've been picking up just a bunch of accessories that are blush pink and I'm so excited to show you guys because I've always told you guys my favorite color is like a rosy blush pink I just don't ever like really like to wear it as clothing or anything like that um, but it's always been my favorite color so I want to pick, show you guys everything that I have picked up from Amazon and as you guys can also see I have a little bit of a different setup I'm trying to just change kind of like the way that my videos have been feeling lately just a little bit more relatable um, kind of how I used to film when I was in my old house um, I feel like I kind of just overwhelmed you guys with so much change drastically when I first moved and it was just kind of like backdrops and this and that and I felt like it was a little overwhelming um, so I'm kind of just trying to tone it down a little bit with my background and I actually feel like it looks really cute. I have like the little ebuttocks. So you guys have seen the setup in my old videos. Um, so I'm just kind of obviously bringing this back a little bit. So yeah, I'm going to get right into all the stuff that I got. If you guys are new to my channel, hi, my name is Blanca Yvette. And um, if you guys are not new to my channel, then welcome back. So if you guys are interested in everything that I have picked up, then just keep on watching. The very first buy that I'm going to show you guys that I actually have been seeing a lot of you guys purchase. It is this pink water bottle. And I have been in the hunt for just a bottle, water bottle that you can take places and it's not super bulgy but you're still getting like your water intake. I love that it does tell you to refill so a lot of the water bottles literally gave you a gallon of water and you have this big jug that you were carrying around which is unrealistic like you want to be able to put this in your bag. It fits perfectly in my purse um, in the big bag the Neverfull from um, Louis Vuitton that I carry for my baby's like diapers and stuff. It fits in there perfectly so I can take it everywhere. Um, it has the strap that I can hold onto it and on the front it does show the times so it says 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. and then at 1 p.m. you would refill and then you would go right back up and there would be 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and by 7 p.m. you should already be done drinking your water. So a lot of you guys have been loving this water bottle because trust me I've been seeing all of the purchases that you guys have made on Amazon and it also has like this little latch up here and then it like pops right open and then you just kind of suck out of it like a straw so it's also really cool because Max um when he's drinking out of it he obviously knows how to suck out of a straw already Camila he's, she's barely learning but we can you know I can give him water give myself water if we're out stuff like that so we don't have to like stop and get like a water bottle or anything but it does have carry 32 ounces of water and then obviously it would come up to 64 once you're done drinking all of your water but this one is probably one of my favorites and like I mentioned I will have all of the stuff linked down below for you guys as well as my Amazon page anything that I have ever purchased on Amazon I will not ever purchase but like my favorite stuff that I have purchased on Amazon will be linked for you guys that way you guys can take advantage of the Amazon page and see all the stuff that I love to buy and follow me on there you guys will see all the good stuff the new stuff that I've also purchased so you guys can buy it as well sorry Message. The next one that I'm going to show you guys are accessory boxes. So I'm going to start with these two here and these are obviously more squared. They're the blush toned. They have a clear um, a clear top. I was going to say that by the way. A clear top and you can fit anything from like scrunchies, from um, accessories for like your cell phone or anything like that accessories if say you have them on your desk you can put like notepads you can put honestly you can put anything which is why I love that they don't have like little compartments or anything they're just made for you to just put stuff I put all of my iWatch bands in there so I have like black ones um, that I also picked up on Amazon I have them linked as well down below I got this blush pink one and then I have like a darker pink one here and then also added all of like the little tools that you use to basically um, all the little accessories to change the bands. 
and these come in, I believe, twos, if I'm not mistaken. So they come with two and then two. But these here, I'm so freaking excited to show you guys, guys. Like, I, when I saw these, I was like, oh my god. Like, how did I not know about these before? Because they're so convenient. You can literally put anything on them. And um, I got one with actual dividers and then one that doesn't have dividers. Just so I can show you guys how people use them they're supposed to be like sunglass cases so you can put your sunglasses in each one but i'm not using it for sunglasses just because i usually keep mine in the actual like box that they came in but this one here you can put all of your accessories so like it has the clear case as well and then inside i put my bobby pins in the first container i don't know if you guys can see but i put my bobby pins in the first container and then this one's empty and then i put like my little pins that put on your hair when you're doing your makeup so your hair doesn't fall forward and then I put my scrunchies my Ligas um, hair ties those aren't scrunchies they're hair ties and then I put on the very last one I put like clear little bands so whenever I do like a side pony or anything like that but it basically keeps all of my accessories separated in place you can use them for jewelry you can use them for sunglasses like they come in um, you can pretty much put anything on these boxes and honestly guys like I'm like an organized freak like I love to just know where everything is at so this has really made stuff really easy for me those come individually so I got two of those and this is what it looks like with nothing inside and like I said, your glasses would fit perfectly. Let me go over there, baby. Um, and then this last one doesn't have any compartment. So you literally would just be able to put it. So here, you can put like notepads, pens, pencils. Um, just depends where you're having them, obviously, in your room. Like you can put these in your closet or you can put these in your office. You can put these um, in your bathroom. You can put them just anywhere where you can just have stuff organized. You will find a reason to have them in your home. I promise and guarantee you guys. Like... They're so freaking cute, and on top of that, they're so convenient to be able to just store stuff. So moving on to jewelry, I wanted something where I can store my jewelry uh, separately, but that was a little bit more compact and smaller. Um, I would put jewelry in those boxes if it was just to stay in my room, but because I do go out sometimes to take outfits of the day, um, and I don't know exactly what accessory i'm going to use for what outfit i'll usually pack like a bag and stuff and i like to carry my jewelry with me so these were super convenient when i got these i think they're made for like crafts where you put like maybe beads in there um i forgot what the use of them were naturally for but i basically picked two of them up and they're just made out of plastic honestly you they have like a little front they don't look the cutest or anything like that but you can make it as big or as small as you want. So I love that it has like these adjustable little dividers because you can put like thicker jewelry or you know smaller jewelry in each little compartment. Just fix this in each little compartment. So in each little um, area, I'll have one necklace, and it also keeps them from not getting tangled or anything. Necklace will separate itself in each compartment, so it helps with like tangling and all of that good stuff like we know my businesses get super tangled all the time so I love that I can just separate everything in there and then I have one for gold I also have oh I think I picked up four there's a silver one I just don't think I have it here oh yeah it's right behind me so I have another gold one this one has all of my earrings and like chunkier necklaces as well as like rings so each little compartment like see these here they're a little bit bigger they're hoops so I was able to place them there and then I have like little earrings and then I just I'm able to separate them and you can form them to whatever you want them to be. And then I also have a silver one. So I don't really wear a lot of silver jewelry. I'm wearing silver right now, but I think I have very little silver jewelry. Um, I have more gold, but this is the one that I have for my silver. So I believe I picked up four, if I'm not mistaken. I'm, I'm trying to figure out how many um, they come in. But like I said, I will have everything linked down below for you. Now the next um, storage box that I'm going to talk to you guys about is this one here. And all of these are from M Design. So that's why they have obviously the same color and the same plastic and stuff. But the top actually removes all on top. And these are really good for 
closets because you can just insert this like in your closet pull it out whenever you need it's good for like filing paperwork filing um like pictures if you're somebody who actually prints your pictures out i have a whole like chest full of pictures um if you're somebody like me who likes to actually print out your pictures you can put pictures in here um separate them by date i'm telling you guys like there's always a reason to have a bunch of storage because it keeps things super tidy super clean in your home and you always know where everything's at so i love this one i use it for my cell phone cases because i have a shit ton of them i always buy cases like crazy and then every time that i upgrade my phone i always have to like whenever i give away like my phone because my phone i'll either trade it in or i'll give it away um to like one of my nieces and nephews or somebody that might want that phone i always give them like all of my cell phone cases with that phone so with this new phone this is the 11 plus i believe or pro max i don't know what they call it but I picked up a whole bunch of cases that I also got on Amazon. So a lot of you guys were asking me about my cell phone cases. This one here with the Apple sign, it is not from Apple. It's actually from Amazon. And the Apple one, the original one, I think it's like $40, $39.99. I got this one for only $7 on Amazon. So I got that one. And then I also have, I got that one Harrison. I got this like jelly pink one. I got, these are all and then I got this one that's like kind of shiny and has diamonds on it. I got this sunflower one. Oh, no. no, that's why we carry our as well. I got this sunflower one on Amazon. I got this cheetah print one on Amazon. And then I got these three here as well. And they're kind of just like neon toned. And I just love switching out my cases. You guys already know that every time I would post pictures, I always have like a new case. I like to match my phone to my outfit sometimes i'm just weird like that um and then these over here are just a little bit thicker and sturdier they're from valley caviar you guys have heard me promote them before i love their cases because they're just so so sturdy you can drop your phone a hundred million times and it really protects your phone with the amazon ones of course they're cheaper so the jelly is a little bit more on the cheaper side so you are definitely taking a risk more if your phone breaks or anything like that because they're not like the most supportive you're literally buying them because they look cute um so with these you offer these obviously get more support this one is actually from a casemate a lot of people were asking me about this one it's the one that like changes colors i got this one from casemate i got it at verizon when i went to get my new phone and i just picked it up just because i needed a case at the time but those can become very expensive velvet caviar i do have a coupon code with them if you guys want to save some money and pick some velvet caviar cases from them um but like cases from like your carrier from verizon when you go shopping or anything like that they become very very expensive so that is why i actually love shopping on amazon because they're super affordable so I picked up two of these, as you guys can see out here, one here, and it just keeps things very organized. I haven't set them up in my room perfectly yet because I was waiting to do this video. Once I do this video, I'll post it on one of my vlogs and you guys will see exactly what I used everything for. So speaking of cases, I also have my AirPods. They are back at my mom's house because I left them there like a dumbass. So I wanted to show you guys. The cases that i just picked up for them i'm going to be going back home in a couple of days so i wanted to just show you guys obviously they're empty but i wanted to show you guys the two cases that i got so i have this one that's clear and then it has like the pink outline over and then this one is just kind of like a rubbery case for my airpods so amazon has amazing cases for airpods this one has like a little string so you can just connect like on the side and then like carry it but i don't really like attaching this thing to it so these are super affordable, super cute. I think I paid like seven or eight bucks for each little piece. So the next purchase that I made was these cute little glass blush holders. So I got them for my actual desk. I'm getting a new beauty room desk soon and you guys are going to see how cute these are going to look on top. I just have too much clutter. The little table that I have right now doesn't hold my makeup anymore. So I want to just have something displayed. So when I'm doing my makeup, it's a little bit easier for me to just grab and go. Um, so these here are for Q-tips and then these are for my little like face pads, um, to remove like my makeup or remover pads. I don't know what you guys call them. Um, and then these are the Q-tips. They are made out of glass, so be very careful with them because I'm always careful to make sure that they're not going to break or anything. The top of it is plastic, but the actual jar itself is glass, but they're so freaking cute guys. Like they just go with the whole room. I love how 
it just brings everything together and it's like these smallest little things these look amazing on bathrooms like say if you have like your bathroom and you have like a cute little pink curtain with a little uh, pink um, rug and then you just put these like on the side by your sink they're gonna look so freaking cute so love these they're probably one of my favorite okay so the next one that i'm gonna show you guys since we're staying with cases is my laptop case i get so many questions on my laptop case and honestly it's probably been one of my favorite cases that i have ever purchased like ever and i've shown you guys a lot of cases and they've been cute they're really nice but honestly this one i just love how simple it is i used to be very into patterns and stuff like that so now i'm a little bit more um just very a little bit plainer i mean, like if i couldn't go like if i could have not gotten any more basic right but i just like things to just look a little bit more simple more classy um very minimalistic so i love that it has the apple cut out in front of the laptop that um just shows obviously that it's an apple mac book pro and then inside of it i have a pink a keyboard cover as well. I also have like a screen protector on the actual case itself that um, you guys can also get on Amazon. But this one, like I said, guys, has been one of my favorite, 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 favorite laptop cases. If there's any of them that I have ever recommended, this one by far has to be my favorite. And so random stuff that you did not know that you guys actually need. This one here is a head scrubber. Okay, so before you guys think I'm crazy. If you guys have never used one of these, you guys are crazy because you guys literally need one. When you shampoo and condition your hair, just using this on your scalp as you're like massaging the freaking shampoo and conditioner through your hair is literally life changing. Like you're never going to want to get out of the shower. You're just going to be over there like. It's literally the best thing ever, guys. I absolutely love being able to just massage my hair and really like lather it and like get in there and I wash my hair only twice a week so I like to this is that's just what's been helping my hair um I used to wash my hair every day morning night morning night morning night because I shower twice a day I shower in the morning I shower at night so I used to just wash my hair every day and I started noticing that my hair would get super oily if I would not wash it the next day um, so then my hairstylist told me like the reason why it's getting oily is because it's so used to you always washing all of the oils from your hair that it's becoming oil because that's how it's surviving. So now that I've been able to wash my hair twice a week, my hair just feels healthier. It's growing a lot faster than it normally does. Um, it just feels really nice and obviously on top of like all the shampoos and everything that I have been using for my hair, but this has been a big plus in my hair routine. So another shower accessory is this one here you put it on your shower and you basically put your foot up on top you do have to make sure that it is nice and sturdy because it will fall off if you don't set it upright i was having a little bit of trouble with it until i finally got grasp to it on my shower um i don't have like the little benches or anything that you sit down in your shower so it was hard for me to like shave my legs i literally had to put my leg all the way up to like the wall and like hold my leg and like i was trying to shave and it was just like it was it was hard you know what I mean like shaving my legs like it literally got to the point where I was like having to sit on the floor and like shave my legs as the water like running on top of my head like it was a serious problem so I got this on Amazon and it's been working amazing for me there was a couple of negative reviews oh, thank god sorry Louis he scared both of us it's because Elisa is upstairs freaking doing weights and they just dropped a weight and freaking scared the shit out of me um so the I forgot what I was going to say. Oh, it did have a little bit of negative reviews, which made me feel like maybe I shouldn't buy it. But I, I'm the type of person that even if someone tells me like that movie sucked or that was horrible or oh my God, the food was disgusting. Like I'm the type of person that I like to make my own judgment. I don't ever really listen to what people say in the sense of like when they recommend stuff, like I'll take their advice, but I like to make my own judgment for things. So I was like, you know what, even though it has like horrible, horrible reviews, um, they weren't that horrible, but they were just like, it, it doesn't hold. Um, I was finally able to try it myself and it worked amazing for me. So this is why I'm letting you guys know that there were people that were having like negative um, thoughts about this, but it has worked amazing for me and uh, I would recommend it if I really didn't love it, but it's bomb. Like your feet really do stay pretty sturdy, but like I said, grab a nice little section that you know is going to just suck and hold because that's how you set it up on there. 
So back to organization stuff for your closet or for just whatever you want to organize it with, um, where you want to use these organizers on. I got these clear dividers and they work absolutely amazing if you have a closet that doesn't have a lot of space and you want to like set up your t-shirts and basically um, put them in the middle and you can separate like t-shirts, jeans, um, leggings and you just put this little divider in the middle and it helps you with so much space in your closet. I saw actually these on TikTok and I love how they really just separated everything for me. I use them specifically for my purses. So I have a section in my room where I have like all of my handbags, like my designer bags, and I wanted them to just, you know, have a little space in between where they can just stand nice and pretty. I wear a lot of clutches. I wear a lot of like crossbody bags. Um, that don't have like a form where you can just stand them up by themselves. So the fact that I can just, you know, I can put a handbag right in the middle of this and then separate them like that. Um, it has really just made my closet look super nice. It looks really cute and it's mainly for looks when it comes to why I'm using it just because it looks really nice. And I'm going to show you guys a video so you guys can see exactly what it looks like. But um, it has kept my purses just looking really cute and nice. I cannot wait until... I can show you guys like the built-in closet, how like my vision is looking for my actual room. Um, you guys are going to see exactly why these are just going to make everything look so put together and just really nice and everything. But they work amazing and like I said, if you're someone who has very little storage in your closet, they work amazing for separating your t-shirts, your leggings, your sweats or anything like that if you don't have like cajones and stuff. I'm gonna move to like exercising stuff. So I have a, a gym that is upstairs in my house and we got a squat rack, we have like a treadmill, we have weights up there. So when the whole coronavirus started, um, well he says obviously you guys know he has been one to always go to the gym like every day 24-7. He would wake up at 5 in the morning and go to the gym. So that was like a big, big thing that happened for him where he was just like shoot like there's no gyms like um what am I gonna do so he started like working out outside running and eventually we started building a gym like you guys know this has always been a big 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 like dream of mine I've always wanted to have a gym even though I'm not one to like always work out because like you guys know I got BBL like yes I took the lazy way out I'm not one to like really work out and stuff but a lot of that had to do because of not being able to really go to the gym because it just makes you feel really uncomfortable I don't know if it's just me but I've always experienced just being very uncomfortable I don't know what it is with guys thinking that the gym like I've never had so many guys stare at me in, the, in like in a normal place as they do in the gym like guys have never seen girls at the gym before that they feel like they just need to make them feel uncomfortable and that was obviously something and I don't mean that like I hope nobody takes this like oh she thinks she's so cute like she doesn't want to go to the gym she doesn't want people staring at her no like it's literally uncomfortable like people make you feel uncomfortable um and it's something that I have been dealing with for a very long time there would be moments where I would go and I would only go with like Lisa's or I would only go if I had people with me um I never really like to be by myself and that's just maybe like an anxiety that I just have with gyms um I've always felt like that and I always told Lisa's like I just wish I could really 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 get into the routine of going to the gym um but I hate going without you and then he would go at five in the morning and I'm not a morning person. Like I know that's something that I need to change, but I am not a five in the morning person. Like 738, we're pushing it. Um, so I told him I was like, I just want to like build my own gym and just feel like I'm comfortable up there. So we finally have that and we've been buying just like stuff, just to make it a little bit easier and just feel a little bit, you know, like I'm adding like my little touches in there that are like pink. But I bought these bands and they are for exercising and they fit so freaking amazing. There's different sizes. There's, there's medium, light, and heavy. So this is based on how much tightness is on them. You use them around your, like under your knees so you can, or above your knees so you can exercise, squat. You can use them for a whole bunch of stuff. And I absolutely love that they're just cute and girly. I will put these in my gym bag. And I'll be able to just take them with me. I have, I should have brought the freaking gloves. I bought like gloves. I'll have a whole, um, what's I'm gonna call it? A whole workout section on my Amazon favorites page. So you guys can see all the stuff that I buy anytime, like gym bags or um, we just bought gloves for the actual bar because it can blister your hands. And to be honest with you, like I like 
Lisa's has a bunch of blisters on his hand, so I just got him some gloves and now he's like loving them. So like I have like gloves for him and then we have like the anklets for weights, um, just a bunch of stuff that we purchased. So I'll link those. I just wanted to show you guys like the cute stuff. Um, and then this one is one that I have actually been loving. It's a hot cream. If you put it on before you work out or even to bed sometimes, um, I would recommend just usually when you're working out because that's when you're sweating the most. You would put this on your stomach. It does burn a little bit in the beginning, but then after a while, it starts easing into your skin and it basically makes you sweat like crazy. So it just helps tighten. It's great for um, cellulite. It's good for like tightening up the skin. Um, and it also is good for like stretch marks, anti-aging, so your skin doesn't get like all like nasty and stuff. Um, so this is what it says. It's a full body skin toning and tightening treatment for men and women. Um, it has deep hydrating formula, so it softens and soothes and nourishes, nourishes your skin. So we would put this and then a faha over it and then obviously like run the treadmill, do what you gotta do and um, that works amazing as well. And then lastly, lastly I have this pink bar. I bought a black one for Lisa's and I have a pink one for myself. Um, you place this on your squat rack and you put it on the back so then that way when you're doing your squat it just sits right on your neck and then you're able to just make your squats because that bar hurts a lot. I've been trying to buy a bench belt um, if you guys want to recommend one. I saw one on Amazon but I didn't really see um, too many options or anything like that so if any of you guys want to recommend a bench belt for me like one to squat so... A lot of people like if you don't have like a good form or if you're lifting really really heavy you can mess up your back by squatting so I've been wanting to get one but I just don't know if I should go from Amazon or if I should actually buy like an expensive one because I know that those are like important stuff that you really need to invest in um, so let me know in the comments below if you guys recommend any but this one is darker pink I wish they would have had like a lighter pink but it's okay it's literally just for working out um, but I just love how you're able to get like cute stuff it really makes you feel a little bit more like motivated when you have like super it's just like when you go and you buy like cute workout clothes you're like okay like let's go work out now you know but you have to really obviously want to do it in order for it to really happen for you but um yeah guys i have pretty much that's all the stuff that i purchased i'm always buying on amazon if you guys love these videos make sure you guys give it a huge thumbs up let me know if you guys are also feeling this new setup that i have going on if you guys like this better than like the backdrops um, I definitely love listening to you guys and I always listen to everything you guys, you know, are saying and your recommendations. Um, for those of you guys who say it nicely and actually, you know, try to help me out, I appreciate it. Um, I'm glad that, um, you guys are giving me feedback regarding my videos and everything. So I want to make sure that you guys know that I am paying attention and if you guys like this background better, let me know. Um, oh, I also wanted to show you guys a little rolly cart that I got. You guys are going to see here on the picture. Um, I got it on Amazon. It was a little bit more expensive than what you would get like for a white one or a black one at Ikea or Target. But I love that it was pink. I put all of my skincare in there. Um, I'm able to just separate it. You can put just basically anything in there. But you can roll it back and forth, which I absolutely love. Um, but yeah, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys give it a huge thumbs up. Make sure you guys hit the subscribe button if you guys have not subscribed to my channel. I am also going to be having a giveaway today. I'm going to be giving away three lucky girls a $100 gift card to Amazon. All you guys have to do is just comment down below, put your email, your comment, and all you guys have to comment is just letting me know which one was your favorite Amazon pick that I shared with you guys today. I will select a winner for maybe tomorrow or the day after that, depending on when this goes live. Um, I'll maybe give you guys like a day or two to just watch the video, comment, and give everybody a chance to be able to enter. There's three lucky winners. Um, and the three lucky winners are going to get a $100 gift card to shop on Amazon. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys all so much for watching and until next time. Love you guys.